COVID-19 has had a pretty negative impact on millions of businesses nationwide, and that includes thousands right here in Northeast Ohio. However, things might be looking up for the film industry locally. Our digital anchor, Stephanie Haney, joins us now. Stephanie, you spoke with the head of the Cleveland Film Commission, Evan Miller, and he says the pandemic could actually mean more jobs right here in Cleveland. Explain. That's right, Romney. Yes, it looks like Northeast Ohio is uniquely well positioned in the entertainment industry after COVID-19. Here's what the president of the Film Commission told me about why it's looking up. What's fortunate is the entertainment industry is made up of probably some of the most creative people in the world. So, and thankfully everybody's working very collaboratively to figure out what protocols need to be put in place, what testing measures so production can go back safely. I love LA, I love New York, but we're never going to have the population that they do. So just on that alone, we're not going to have those numbers and be able to, you know, open up a little sooner. So. And Evan told me at least some projects in Cleveland are already underway. Listen to this. And we're really excited at the phone calls we're getting. There is a lot of interest. You know, obviously we want to make sure the city, the county, everybody is comfortable and, and smaller scale stuff can get start get going and anything larger scale. We're confident that we will be able to work with various entities as the numbers start to get a little better and get people back to work sooner than later. But he said he thinks maybe the end of this year, but more likely early 2021 for those larger projects. And in the meantime, the Greater Cleveland Film Commission is hosting virtual events. Tonight, there is a live Q&A with one of Ohio's own, Nancy Cartwright, the voice of Bart Simpson. She's from Dayton. She was just nominated for another Emmy this year. She is absolutely incredible. That's at 7 p.m. tonight. That During that, you can expect to hear stories about how she came up, where she came from in her roots, and all kinds of fun things, Romney. It's free, and we have the link to register with the full interview with my conversation with Evan on WKYC.com. How neat, one, to know that the film industry is coming back locally. That's pretty cool. And then also, I didn't realize she was from Ohio, one of the most recognizable voices on TV. Absolutely. One of the most sought after, highest paid voice actors right here in our own backyard. We're very proud for that. Very nice. Thanks, Stephanie.